Pick up the now. Hey, what? you the courier. Smuggler says he passed you the package. Thing is, that was my package you stole. Which means you owe. Credits or your life. Your choice. Credits are my life. Jettison 10,000 credits. I am not paying you any credits. Just the answer I wanted to hear. Look yeah, you ain't getting shit from me, dude. I'm also in your boy's ship, too, so... Yeah, it's a, it's a good game. You can check it out on Game Pass, too. Did it force me? Is it fine? Hold on. Dude, that's so dumb. Need to start manually saving more frequently. I'm having a lot of fun with it. Um, kind of dividing my time mostly right now between the main quest and exploring our solar system. But after I wrap up with Pluto, then I am done with this solar system. The, there's like 40 solar systems, though, that you can explore. I'm not going to explore all of them because that would take fucking weeks. Um, weeks of content, yeah. Well, it, it's also pretty repetitive. Like, this is the same landscape on every planet. <laughs> And, well, I should say moons anyway. Like uh, all the all the moons pretty much look the same, especially if you're far away from the sun. It's basically just a bunch of ice. That's it. Just a shitload of ice. And holding W. If I had a rover or something, I would maybe consider it, but. I don't. I, I could have sworn that there's rovers in this game that you can unlock later, but I don't have them. So, did you find the flag on Earth's moon? No. No. This is like colonized. Like the the moon is actually colonized. So like there's, and it's all procedural. So. I love how I found water, like, really fast last time, and this time it just ain't fucking here, dude. There should be some out in these, like, rock formations. Thought the game would have silly Easter eggs. Yeah, I mean, I'm sure there are, but yeah, like you can go to Earth. 
You can go to Earth and, and there's literally nothing there. Like it's just a it's a giant dust ball. Which they explain it in the lore that um they basically bleed Earth out of all of its resources, and so that's a lot of the reason why people colonized other planets is because there was nothing there, and now Mars is kinda Mars is kind of the main planet in the solar system. But it's mostly just used for mining operations and nothing else. And then... Uh, they end up finding an Earth-like planet a couple of solar systems away from Earth. And that becomes the... Uh, there should be water over by this site here. I don't know why I haven't found water yet. This is kind of annoying. You can figure out, you can kind of figure out where resources are going to be based on the map before you land, but sometimes you can find things that aren't necessarily on the map just depending on what you do. It's funny because some planets I've had to spend 30 minutes running around trying to find shit, and other planets have taken me like. 15 seconds. Crazy. But yeah, there, there should be... There should be a uh, H2O around here. Since it's an outcropping. Of ice, hopefully. Well, maybe not now. Hold on. Or there were some in the last one of these that I found. what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go back to my ship. What's the actual objective for Endgame? Well, there's a, there's a story where you're like looking for artifacts and stuff. So you're going to like other colonized planets. And hunting down these artifacts that are believed to have been made by aliens. But you start as like a miner on a planet and you guys are looking for an artifact, but then when you find it, uh, you have like an out of body experience and then they recruit you to join this like explorers league type situation. There was H2O over here, dude. This is so annoying. I'm about to just go to a different landing zone to find it. I know that there was some outside of this base, though, because I had literally found it and then left before I got killed by those pirates. So, I don't know what's going on. But I feel like I'm getting trolled here. The other option is to just pick a different landing site. Not a big deal, but this is kind of annoying. I don't think it changes. I mean, the the areas are procedural, but like when you load in, it's already picked it all. Here we go. water, etc. Uh, no, it doesn't. It shouldn't, anyway. Time to be Pluto. The dwarf planet. We have an adoring fan in our ship crew.
Well, I saved before, so we should be fine. Pluto. All right. So, are there? Oh, I am. I am in combat. Okay. Wasn't sure if it was gonna. Level twenty. Jesus Christ. specifically locked on me which kind of sucks can't you not fast travel I mean, this ship is ass, so... This is a ship that I stole. Pretty sure they killed off. Pretty sure they killed off literally all of the defending forces in this area. For it. Uh, I'm just exploring right now. Mapping out our solar system. Landing 
site here. Structures. Here's H2O. There's also titanium, it looks like. No, that's tungsten. Tungsten itself is actually quite valuable, so I'll take that. I'm gonna climb the mountain here and uh, check out the ship up here. up here and maybe we can secure ourselves a potentially better ship. What kind of ship do we have here? That's UC. Well, we're not fucking with UC and they just took off and left, so we're not sticking around. The big resource hall in Seoul is definitely Titan right here. This moon has a ton of really good shit on it. So I think at some point I will probably, I will probably set up a farm here later. Yeah, guys, we have, uh, We have surveyed all of this solar system. Now I have a dream home somewhere. said it was the in blue dream home wait, wait oh here it is here it is you have a mortgage you have to keep paying a weekly payment unless you either pay it off or let them foreclose So I Let's go to New Atlantis and figure out what we got going on here.
Yeah, I love it. Well, we can check out this moon real quick. Pretty much just craters. Uh, helium. And aluminum. There is an industrial outpost here, so we can go ahead and land there. That's fine. Just get to the bottom of this uh, Did I level up recently? Hold on. Still need to scan a lot more materials too. Alright, that should be the aluminum. I don't think I have a good stock of aluminum right now, so we're gonna go ahead and grab some of that. need to find helium deposits which usually you can find those up here well, here you go right there would you have a look at that there's some helium for you chief This is basically the new earth right here, chat. Mountains. And these, these are like the real planets right here that you want to get into because they'll show you a lot of what you need resource wise. There's also like actually wildlife on the planets and stuff. There's argon, probably water, and maybe even lead up here, I would say, in the North, the North Pole. Can't land in the ocean. Frozen mountains. How about we go to the frozen mountains first? Three numbers between 1 and 59. 59, 58, and 57. I don't know. I don't know, dude. I don't know what we're picking numbers for. Right, so there's your Argon. Tufted Snow Willow. Old Cave Nettle. There's like actually kind of sort of normal gravity on this planet too. It's not... It's not huge, but you know. You can't go as far either on uh,
planets that have like closer to normal gravity. Reefwalker scavenger. on lottery oh well in that case general direction of these things surveying gaming right, we're gonna head up this way I just completely gave you, like, numbers that probably suck ass. Don't rush the sky. Wouldn't want to overlook anything valuable. There's actually, like, an overabundance of, uh... Resources and whatnot over here. Of course, we have H2O. Why wouldn't we? Ooh, there are scavengers over here. Very nice. Uh, this one looks dead. Poor fellow. out the natural stuff there's the final resource nice plenty of resources here in the northern the northern sections old cave nettle so there's a root that we're looking for is this right here A what? A crocodont. Oh boy. Oh! Dude, he deleted me. guys are actually I think there's a few of these guys around here
could have sworn there was another one. I mean, there might be. I just haven't crossed it. Yeah, I could have sworn I saw one out here that was level one. Yeah, here it is. Also chemicals over here too. Let me see. Here. Right here. Alright, well there's all the resources. Alright, let's go to the natural site over here. There's a lot of wildlife out here. Holy shit. Unexplored ecological feature. Fibers and other biotic structures merge into a nutrient rich storage cluster. Huh. Interesting. Interesting. Alright, let's keep gathering that cold cave nettle. I want to head towards the life signs over here. Cliff Laurel. Let's see what this Cliff Laurel is over here. the cave nettle here there is a lot of uh, survey data on this planet range. I don't feel compelled to uh Mess with the cliff laurels. So. Or not the not the cliff floral, sorry. The uh, the other stuff. Alright, so we have I meant the stuff that I've already scanned. These bugs are pretty well littered around here.
I think that's the one that I encountered earlier. So, good source of argon up here. In the North Pole, basically. I don't know if I would really call this the North Pole. There's another natural site up here I'm curious to take a look at, too. Not too far away. doesn't have to be frozen well no it doesn't but this is an earth-like planet so I, I more or less expected that there would be similarities in the northern regions tendrils filter through the air Microbial colony. Sentient microbial colony. Damn. Tempted to chase these guys around and scan a few of them. I need to get a couple more. There's more bugs over here, too. I think I could probably polish off the bug list here. chance no okay huh. okay consortium Are you some kind of an acrobat oh yeah okay, so this isn't too dissimilar to the one we encountered earlier these parrot hawks flying around I think we can probably get the scan on those good stuff right, let's see if we can at least find one more of those cliff laurels
I know there's a structure over there. Here's another cliff laurel. And I've got all the flora for this biome. It says that there's more fauna, but I'm gonna try a different part of the planet. You lifting off right away or you need a little bit nice if you could like back out of the planet and then uh, it looks like you can do that hold on let's see and we've already got all the resources but there are different kinds of terrain so there's forests there's deciduous forest mountains Coniferous forest. Deciduous forest by far has the most to work with. Okay, so I guess you can I guess you can travel that way. That's nice. Plotting courses out that way and whatnot. Oh wow. Your landing skills never ceased. Act. Coral bug. Holy shit. We are watching, uh, Nature do its thing here, chat. things here. Holy cow. Jeez. the hill we're gonna go to that natural thing here in a second something useful out here all right so the stick weed the Aurora Palm. Those are two of the major things we got going on here. Glossy stickweed and Aurora Palm, but there is, I'm pretty sure there is one more. 
that we haven't come across yet. There's a lot of wildlife out here in the forest. That's kind of cool. A herding cutterhead herbivore. Okay. Put that in my handy dandy notebook for fauna. Ow. All right, that guy didn't take kindly to what I had going on. That's okay. Just, just relax, just relax. Get away from me, dude. Oh, dude, he's... Oh, he's pissed. Let me get away, dude. Just let me get away. Uh, ow! These guys are fast. Holy shit. Jeez. Explore geology feature. Dude, how is this fucker catching me still, man? I'm dead. I'm so dead. Jesus Christ. Terror morph? Oh boy. So fun. Well, let's quick save real quick. So what's up? Why is it not? is not any wildlife that I can scan though so I don't think I don't think 
like I really want to be near that right now. That was epic. That was epic, chat. Alright, we have got all of the flora. Not gonna lie, a little curious on the fauna situation though. These little scavengers that are crawling around, I think are the only other one in this biome. Maybe you can get that to point us to the nearest restaurant. Aha. Yeah, those little, those little guys, you know? Just looking for where I can scan those little guys. Those little cheeves, you know? They, they're, they're just cute little cheeves, chat. Just a cute little chief. They don't seem to be in like they don't gather around in like large quantities. They are peaceful though. They drop cosmetic resources. I do tend to notice them near packs of those other guys though. Funny enough. Does seem like they tend to be where these cutter heads are. Yeah, see, right here. You can find them in the mountains too, so I think at this point we, we might. I mean, I only need one more, so I guess. I guess we could go ahead and just look for the last one. Maybe see if we can reach this other site as well. Wow, there is a fucking war going on between these two species, though. Jesus Christ. Actual fucking war going on.
able to find that. Not gonna be able to climb that one. See if we can get around this mountain. Like just on the other side of this mountain, but this mountain range goes quite a ways, Chief. Quite a ways. Alright, well. We don't have to do any of that stuff, I guess, but I was hoping to have a fast travel point out here. Structure out that way. this is kind of the edge of the mountain so maybe we can end up back here after all aha there we go We can find one more. Here it is. One more of those little guys. Funny enough, though, there's still one more type of fauna out here that I have not seen yet. So. It did not say biome complete, my chief, so. I haven't seen it though, so I'm just gonna go ahead and leave. And I'm sure that either the carnivorous forest or the um, mountains potentially have the rest of what I'm looking for. And we made it to the melted glacier, chief. All right, let's get out of here. Can I? Hold on. I so you can fast travel that way. That's kind of cool. I picked up something you I have a skill point that I can spend. Okay. Let's go. Okay, so that was the deciduous forest. Let's go to some carnivorous forest. Actually, you know what? Hold on. Where's the mountains? Be some mountains around here somewhere. Yeah. Go to the other side of the world, maybe? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, chat. Oh, yes. Landing site locked. Take us in. It's a little more than mountains. This is fucking desert, dog. This is desert, my chief. All right, but we do have we do have some stuff. Broadleaf rose. That is the final flora. Let's 
So we're basically just looking for that. More or less. Uh, there's also... Oh, the Tusk Frog. That's right. I remember that guy from earlier. I'm pretty sure that the Tusk Frogs, though, are pretty much available anywhere. Very defensive species. Natural sights around here. Am I thinking this way is where I want to go? Didn't see any over here, so we could probably just climb this hill and then go about our day. See if we get a better view of. So there is some over there. Also, a hunting tusk frog over here, too. We could go, let's go to this site first though. things right here. Yeah, the hive structures. We're going to double back this way. I need to see if that frog shows up in carnivorous forest. I think it does. But I think we're going to need to double check just to make sure we're gaming. in a while though Should hopefully be able to find out if they're in carnivorous forest. 
Keep scanning. I'm sure there's something mm. nearby. No, it doesn't say. look like a mountain range to me though i'm gonna be honest like there's hills and stuff but i wouldn't call this the mountains literally says that this is mountains this is more like desert than mountains I think I may just end up going to the carnivorous forest just to see there's two over here Actually, Seventy-five percent scan. So I just need like two more. Oh, they're not happy. the coniferous forest probably is going to have what I need mountains over this way here we go I just like to pick random spots on the planet just to make it seem like I've explored the whole planet you know giga business getting the data that we need to make it all happen, Chief.
for specific alien life, chief. Ooh, the crocodont. Frozen mountains and coniferous forest. Okay. Duly noting the frozen mountains. Might have to go back there. I feel like I saw a lot more of those guys in the forest. Or in the in the mountains, the frozen mountains. Two hundred thousand credits for parking? Nah, fuck you, dude. You can get the fuck out of here with that, dude. I ain't paying it. No shot. I need to know. What is this? Alright, robots. Oh, it's, it's you see. Okay. Do you see we're gaming? I don't want to go back to the frozen mountains and see if that might be a better option for me. These guys are kind of rare, not gonna lie. This planet's kind of an important one to survey, though, because this one is like the planet. Like, basically, the new Earth. So. that I may go back to the frozen mountains. Oh wait, here we go. Dude, get away from me. Darn. Darn saved right before that so we should be okay send ish the bounty hunter after me send him i don't like the game it's fun i've kind of just been lost and caught up in just the whole exploration of it all honestly it's almost overwhelming but like i'm just having so much fun that like, really cool getting to see all the biomes. And of course, the wildlife and all that.
since I've done this part now. could look in the mountains or we could go back to the deciduous forest nothing to do in the frozen mountains so it would seem that whatever the last species is is hiding out here somewhere just haven't found them yet Yeah, like the game a lot. Ship landing site, huh? Don't mind if I have a look. Who we got? Definitely some fauna that likes to uh, remain hidden. are freaky looking they're also hyper aggressive too figure out whatever this last creature is that I haven't found yet. Whatever it is, I don't think I've seen a single one. I'm at a ship landing site, but there's no ship. Ship landing site, no ship, chief. Yeah, I don't know if it's just... I'm getting unlucky or maybe I just need a new seed. I don't know. You'd think that there would be something around here somewhere. seeing uh, anything. Oh, this is a pretty large complex. I 
communication station. going on here but not sticking around to find out don't quite understand why I haven't seen a single one of these fauna and it very clearly says Maybe I'll just come back to it later. I feel like uh, spending the time, you know. Well. Oh, I'm in combat still. Huh. Oops. Oops. Let me reload my shoddy real quick. District. Let me make myself another G Fuel here soon. Let's pop into Outland while we're here and see if Joe has anything useful to add to our arsenal. Let's go talk about the mortgage. plate right now and you don't look like a new hire stumbling through their first day and who exactly are you member of constellation Constellation, as in the elusive and mysterious constellation that that the one and oh, only wow i used to read stories about you guys when i was a kid um, wow wow this is Perfect. <laughs> Kiss me, really. I have a business proposition for you that could uh, help us both out. Very lucrative. Uh, ooh, buttering me up pretty thick. Ooh. <laughs> so you see, right? Giving me that. Giving me the grease, <laughs> dude. Did I? You are just the person I'm looking for. For what? Well, confession time. I might just be a little desperate. See, the world of credit analysis, you know, dealing with deadbeats and reprobates is, uh, well, it's a tough field. And what I need is a ringer, someone that can collect some of our top delinquent offenders. What I need is you. You work with me, and the fee you get will be huge. How many credits? Well, I can tell you're eager. That's good. But we'll start small and work our way up to the worst offenders. Yes! <laughs> so, we got a galaxy class con man took out a loan to franchise a restaurant. Turns out, surprise, it was a scam. And Dieter Maliki jumps system. And he's holed up in a literal shack in the middle of nowhere. Can you believe it? Yeah. <laughs> uh, the job is simple get Dieter to pay. And we don't want him dead. We don't want him hurt. Just close his account like an honest citizen. Yeah, what happens if he does die? 
If he dies, then his assets go to probate, and we can get paid. So if he forces you into an it's you or him situation, it's A-OK -okay for Galbank's bottom line if you choose him. <laughs> but I cannot stress this enough. This is not the ideal outcome. We wanted him liquidated, and we'd have put a tracker on him. All right, that's fair. Dangerous? Well, I mean, yes. We're not the only ones looking for him. And you don't dome up on a dust ball unless you're serious about dodging your civic responsibilities. Fair. How do I get him to pay? Well, you may need to lean on him, scare him. Nothing illegal. Just talk to him. And don't listen to any sob stories he tells you. Any job I give you, I guarantee there's not some poor sick aunt that needs credits for surgery. These are scum. You got it. Scum. Flagrantly violating the terms of their gal bank agreements. All right, let's do it. I'll send over all the details. You find Dieter and bring his account current. Decided to take a break from exploring to collect some debts. Hmm. hmm. Not exactly a constellation worthy pastime, but I'll follow your lead. I hate to end on this note, but you know, not everyone's a straight arrow. Mm -hmm. You cut a deal with Dieter. Honestly, I have no way of knowing. But don't expect any more jobs from me. Best of luck. I believe in you. Fair. Together we can really make a difference. I'm gonna talk to you about my right. house. Small home in the Olympus system, right? There's a balance on that property. Argos Extractors negotiated a very fine loan for you. There are weekly payments, but if you miss a payment, no big deal. It's a pay-as-you-go type of affair. But I think we'd all be happier if you dealt with the mortgage one way or the other. Is that true? This whole thing feels like a ripoff. If I miss a payment, it's all I mean, right. You won't be let into your house without paying, but no ding to your record if you let the property sit. Honestly, it's almost like a locked in rental. Pretty standard for some mining outfits. So what are my loan options here? Certainly. So there are two ways to take care of a loan for good. One's easy. Just pay off the balance, then the house is yours, free and clear, and you are one very happy new homeowner. The okay. other option, less ideal, is just walk away and we foreclose on the property. I don't have 125,000 That credits. is a chunk of change to be sure. But we don't do partial payments. Sorry, it's in the contract. If you get the money, though, we're happy to settle the mortgage for good. You have a good day. Is that right? Is that right? You can steal from the ATM, nice. Sergeant Yumi's looking for a reliable people to help the guard. Contact him if you're interested. We'd all appreciate it. The news, the news network. It took years to get it looking just like this. Well, I guess we could, uh... We've flown across most of the settled systems in all manners of spacecraft. And yet, I still get sick on the NAT. I guess we could do the main quest a little bit. I do want to check out my house, though. Genuine curiosity here. Is there a way to just flat out just run out of the city? I feel like there I feel like there would be. I 
don't know if this is the spot to do that, though. There was seemingly a way out from this way, though. Check out my ship's inventory. Actually has some credits again. Oh, look at this. Better all around stuff for the most part. Assembler plus twenty percent damage against robots. Look, I actually would not use that. Old Earth shotgun. It's quite a bit heavier, but. Nineteen K credits. Huh? Concentration here. I don't want to switch back to my other ship. Got anything you need to offload? Anything I can help you with? Okay, you and no modify problem. my ships here. 11,000 for registration. The Hayes Mobile. Pretty sure you can like literally just jump over the fence and go out into the fucking biome. <laughs> save.
scan any promising leads? Whoa. Look at that. Look at that view, damn. sick to go across this and get a gnarly view of that. Oh wow, look at that too. Probably get a gnarly view of the city if you go down far enough. Well, maybe not because it kind of wraps over this way. scavengers I don't know where in the heck the other fauna is only thing I can think of is like maybe we gotta go into a cave possibly in a cave with some wildlife maybe we could find something there The only place I feel like we haven't checked is the cave. We'll try it. If not, I am going to carry on. I'll probably take a short break here in just a minute, though. I need to stretch my legs out. I've been going for four hours now without a break, so it's definitely about that time. What I'm looking for a flocking sea bat geophage. Well, they're peaceful, but they're very dead. They are. They are dead. Well, at least these two are. Sea bat. It's a cave, so yeah, bats, caves. I feel like those are synonymous. And what do you know? Ah, next time. 
Don't think we're getting that lucky, Chief. But, pretty sick. There were two of them in here, and at least now we know. The fact that it's nighttime might be something as well. Since they are bat, right? Ah, actually. Right here. science, that's for sure. Detect uncommon inorganic resources on planet and moon surfaces. Am I winning? Uh, yeah. I would say so. Increase grav jump range of jump drives by 15%. I actually do really want the level up medicine. It's definitely a good one to do. Good one to do. So there's only uh, four planets in the solar system. There's a lot of shit on this. Holy cow. House is on Olympus. I have things for you. We are on Olympus. Nice.
No moon on this planet. But we do have a house here. Giga Business's home. Oh, yeah. See the dream home. Got a mortgage on it. Landing struts primed. Retro is firing. Take a look at my perk that I chose. I'm assuming this is it. They've locked up my house until I make an interest only mortgage payment of 500 credits. Pay the mortgage. Okay. All right, all right. Yo, look at this. Look at this. A be it's a beautiful property, dude. Dude, look at the luxury toilet, man. Oh my god. This is ours, chat. This is ours. It's all ours. Just need to drop uh, 125,000 if we want to uh, keep it. What do we think, chat? Oh, we got two bathroom. Oh shit. Okay, we got the bedroom, okay. This has got to be the master, right? Is this the master right here? This has got to be the exterior, like, upper side, right? Oh, oh, we got a terrace? Oh, shit. And a ping pong table? Dude, we're gaming. Chad, it's beautiful. We've got a dream home that I'm never gonna go and enjoy because it's, you know. I would never, like, I'm, I'm never gonna spend time there. Zeroing in on anything useful? You know? Yeah, no. And great, yeah, I'm literally. My house is literally situated right underneath a fucking radioactive vein. So fun. Just, you know, it's, it's fine. It's just chilling underneath a giant vein of iridium and uranium. So, you know, it's cool. Oops. You know, it's it's cool. Don't even worry about it, you know? Actually, seems like there's decent resources on this planet, though.
peaceful planet. here. Cool. There's actually a lot of, uh, different kinds of things out here. Pantalum. Haven't found that yet. head toward there was a cave over here somewhere I think I want to head toward that cave Hoping that that cave has most of everything we need. per se. Uh, I don't know where exactly the entrance is, but it's got to be up here somewhere. There we go. Xenogrub. Is that not... Occupied cave. I don't think I've seen an occupied cave before. I don't think this guy's gonna take too kindly to me being in here. Let's just see. Okay, well, it was occupied. Not anymore. Something happened that killed everybody. What, what it was? I'm sure it is just a matter of time before we find out.
dead miner. I mean, I'm getting lost in this cave. I can already tell. If you're searching, then make it quick. About four thousand credits. Okay. stuff. Okay. Wow, there's so much stuff here. Holy cow. Okay. Urban slackware. Actually, I was a little disappointed. I thought that there would be more stuff in here, honestly. At least in the way of like resources and whatnot. A little disappointing. Satisfied with what we found here. For God's sake, drop some of that rubbish already. How about you take some of it? You've got something for me? Braid gear. I'll only carry the good stuff. <laughs> Just kidding. I carry all of the shit that I don't want. How's that? Sort by weight. Oh, wait, 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 no. That's not what I wanted to. Here, take. Take some of these weapons. Okay. Okay. Let's get out of here. I want to say I can just... Cool. All right, let's go. Look at my quests here. Main quest.
gonna go here. I need to take a short break, y'all. I'm assuming there's not gonna be a cutscene when we land right away. It appears things have gone downhill since the last time you were here. Argos has clearly washed its hands of this operation. Indeed. Okay, I'll be back, guys.